select them live. Let's go ahead and head over to my channel and so I can watch things the way you guys watch things. Just give me a minute to get myself right over there. I hope you guys had a great start to your week. So we got some glue, some glue stick, scissors, which we always need. I've got some images to start with and a couple of different containers here. So just uh, in just a minute, we'll get those all started. All right, so we're gonna roll it the way we usually do. This is a brand new heavy roll. I thought we'd go green this time. No rhyme or reason, just because. But that'll get us a good start here. All right, so let's go ahead and zipper this one open. I'll probably work out of this, honestly. I'll put it off to the side. But let's uh, let's get all the images in one spot. Right, let me get in here so I can see if there's anybody in the room. I didn't re I didn't schedule this early, so nobody will. Oh, and I need to mute myself. There we go. All right. Well, hello, everybody. Sherry, Carla, it's Mari. How you ladies doing? All right, I got to do some adjusting on the... Uh, on the uh, camera here. Let's start first with, I think it's down a little low. Let's start by raising that up. Carly, you're alive. Well, that's a start, right? Okay, that's not very good. Right now, let's see about. Uh oh, there's an alarm. It is ten to six. All right. I'm get myself scooched up here. I think that's as close as we're going to get. <laughs> Green. Rained all day. Got soaked twice. And the weather gave you awesome. That is no fun at all. Um, I haven't been outside today, if I'm honest with you. No, I did. I lied. I went out and I brought in the trash can, so... All right, so this is the neighborhood of Teeny. We're making up our own neighborhood. I think we'll have some interesting stuff as we go along. So, and I'm just going to use square images, whether they're uh, up and down or however we're going to do it. And our neighborhood's going to be weird. It's endless, ongoing, extremely varied. Uh, so let's see. And there's a story around every corner. Let's see what we want to start with. What will be our starting piece? Well, we've obviously got some stuff with torn edges. If it's already torn, we're going to go with it. We had some rain, but it stopped, Mari says. You picked up your new glasses. Had to get bifocals. Uh, every time Mike and Els get new bifocals, they hate them. They hate them. You have glasses, but they give you a headache, Carla. I have readers. I probably need prescription glasses, but I'm not going to go. <laughs> oh, no. Well, at least they're nice at the Apple store, usually. You only have to wear them to see far. And you don't drive, so. 
not so much of a problem. And you probably know your local area, right? But we just start with this Bailey's. I do live in Las Vegas. Let's start there. Oh, but this is how I feel most of the housing is around the... We may make this into two, though, because I don't... It's going to be hard to just do stuff at the top. But we will do our best. So we're going to start right here. Not even going to start with a... So we start at the top, I guess. Maybe let's trim some off the top there. Let's just let's make it so that it's easier to... We're going to do this glue book style with overlapping images and try not to, you know, we'll save that for somewhere else. Okay, so it's going to be an interesting ride here, but we will uh, we'll make this happen. Hey, Christine. Is there really another one? I don't... The one we have over here by us is uh, always looking a little grungy and not as well stocked as it used to be. And they're going to put in a new one? All right. I think we're going to start like this. I think that'll be okay, right? And for these first two, obviously, we're just going to line them up because, okay, so let's do that. Or we could do this and put something else down there. Yeah, we'll go that way, I guess. Okay, hopefully we have enough glue for tonight. I didn't refill my glue bottle. But it was sunny when I went outside and then warm. It would kill your paycheck. Yeah, that's the one we go to a lot. I'm, you know, they never have any dye. And, you know, sometimes I buy my dye there if they have the colors I need. They rarely have any good colors. They rarely have any dye, honestly. I just feel like it's not well stocked and it's not well taken care of anymore. It didn't used to be this bad. I don't think it was ever spectacular while I've lived here, but... It didn't used to be as bad as it is. I kind of got the impression that maybe they were going to close that store down, but nothing so far. Don't get me wrong. I like having one close by. It's nice to just run down. Sometimes Elf needs jewelry findings or whatever, but uh, it doesn't give me good vibes, you know. That's poor management. Could be. There's a lot more um, shoplifting going on there than there used to be. And uh, I know they can't follow people out to the parking lot and stuff, but it, the last time we were in there, it seemed like a very blase feel about it. Look, there goes some of our merchandise, you know. Sewing machines, I think. I just feel like they kind of gave up. The cashiers are always nice to us. But I don't feel like, I feel like somebody just doesn't give a, my favorite letter, you know. No fucks were given there, I don't think. Trying to get it lined up here at the bottom. Floating on a sea of glue right now. I need a paper towel. All right. How's the mic went out to the doctor? I'll probably to get the results of their blood work. I haven't talked to them. Okay. You know, my sleep schedule's all ass backwards. I know. Well, and it's not that good. I gotta be honest. Their clearance has not been interesting in the least to at least for my crafting labs are good they changed your neuropathy medicine oh i hope so mari mike has the same trouble 
and he's uh, going off some of his meds uh, because he's hoping to stimulate. He's uh, they've got an, uh, one of those pins that you can stimulate the nerves. So he's going to try and because um, he's having some other issues related to the medication that are um, unpleasant. Hey, Janie, how you doing? Good to see you, girl. Home or, or on the road? So I hope that that improves for you, uh, Mari. Definitely. That is not an ideal situation. Should we? This reminds me of generic city, you know. Just generic city going on. So I think we'll trim it right in the middle of this here. And we'll save this little piece for somewhere else. Where is my trimmer? I will trim it right there. So we'll save that piece. Neighborhood's not very exciting just yet. But you know, for Vegas, we have a casino. And we don't have this kind of row houses here, but our houses are so close together. Well, I cut it too small. What a dork. All right, so let's see. Maybe we'll move this over a little bit. And we'll find something skinny for right there. Skinny. Unlike me, I am not skinny. Da -da 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 -da. That's too tall. Let's see here. Let me grab this stack right here and have a look through it. The church is always a good place, but we need it to be a little taller. A little bit taller. Oh, how about this one? Let's trim this part off right here. Got to Dallas. Going to Dallas tomorrow. Classic cars. Nice. Okay, so let's do that. And then we'll add this one on. Ah, the city at night. It's so much prettier at night than it is during the day. <laughs> I like all the city lights. I do. When we drive up on the hill and you look down on the whole city. Las Vegas is huge, guys. I know a lot of people imagine it's just, you know, the little bit that's down on the strip and stuff. But Las Vegas as a city, very large. And then you get into all the adjacent communities and stuff, you know. Lit up for miles. If you're out in the desert, there is a false horizon. All night long. Because there's that much light. I'm sure it's the same in like other cities. Other really big ones, you know. But I guess because it, once you get out of Vegas proper, you just, uh, and, and, you know, all this, once you actually get out into the desert, say heading out towards Lake Mead, it's uh, a little bit different. All right, we're going to do that. I think that's okay. Twenty minutes from Tyler. We have a ninety-seven Chevy, fifteen hundred in mint condition, and want to get it consignment and sell it. It's been under a cover. Nice car, though. Nice car. Very nice. Oh. That's trying to that's trying to exit stage left over there. I'm gonna move that. I don't know to where. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Uh, 
You can just write down here on the floor. We'll just work from the floor. Okay, so. I have this going the wrong way. Oh, you guys let me do this the wrong way. Shucky darn. Well, we'll just move the drink and we'll roll it off the other side. We'll live with it. We'll live with it. Okay, I had to look glue on. I forgot what I was doing. I got distracted. Okay. It is the roll supposed to be over here rolling that way. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do now. This one will just be different. Different. Somebody sent me a message. Okay. I got to roll my sleeves up. I'm going to dip them in the glue. I just know it. This is my oldest, loosest shirt. It's my comfy shirt. It's thin. I should get rid of it, but I can't bring myself to. It's more like a dress than a shirt now. There we go. Let's go ahead and put a little church right there. Candy, how you doing? Oh, off to bed? Well, thank you for stopping by and visiting us. You sent me a message that just came in. <laughs> oh, you gotta love the computer. All right, let's get this church glued down and see what else we can do. All right, so opinion, should we should we ink this stuff or should we just leave it uninked? I know we've already started a little bit, but should we ink or should we not ink? Got a little, little edge right there. And right there, too. Okay. Nice. You sent me an email. Okay. Hold, please. Let's grab some more images. So, so far, just generic city stuff, right? Use that a little bit here. Oh, now it's upside down. Let's see, curve. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. I haven't looked at my, is that terrible? I haven't even looked at, but I've only been up since like four o'clock. Oh, I'm a bad, bad person. All right, back to, there's one other message in there. Guys, just bear with me, I'm sorry. Let's see. Oh, it's the car. Oh, let's see, I bet it's gorgeous. It's so shiny. And clean. It's very clean. <laughs> That's a good looking car right there. Okay. Oh, nice. It's nice when you finish up a project and you got a little bit of downtime. Okay. I appreciate it, Carla. <laughs> okay. What are we doing here? So, maybe we'll put that at the top. You know, we're going to talk about some of our neighbors doing a little bit of restoration, right? So, we need a place where we can... So we're going to have some inside stuff. Some We're going to presume we can kind of 
you know, our neighbors have shown us some stuff. So we're, I've got some fun ideas. There's a little fountain. You could do that. Let's see. I'm kind of I think like that, maybe. We're janking it all together. You loathe binding. Well, there's always a part of the process that is your least favorite, right? For collaging, for me, is fussy cutting. Hands down, not my favorite thing. All right, so we're just going to put this, we're going to overlap it a tiny, tiny bit like that. Let me put that down. This is the, you know, one of those guys that comes into a neighborhood and builds a house that doesn't match anything else. Up by the lake. We're going to, we have an imaginary city <laughs> where all kinds of things are going to happen. I'm thinking about glue, and I'm looking right at it, and I'm not picking it up. Yeah, yeah. I haven't even eaten today yet. I I got up, and I was doing some stuff. I haven't actually talked to anybody but a dog yet. Dogs are nice, but they're not very good conversationalists. Great listeners, though. <laughs> All right. So what do we want to neighbor our, our asshole neighbor who has a great backyard, but a house that doesn't match the rest of the neighborhood? What shall we call him? This one is a little bit heavy duty. Since we've got the, whoops. Let me just throw something. Um, I'm going to ink the edges on this since they're white and torn. Hopefully it'll blend in a little better. Just the, the left and right edges. And we are sadly out of sourdough bread, so sandwich is not an option for me. I guess that's a little white at the top. Now let's glue it down. <laughs> there you go, Adria. Working out a deal. Sasha does not usually come into my lives, you guys. She's in her room playing a game where she's been all day. Where she is most days. Except yesterday she was at the doctor. I think. And I think she has another appointment tomorrow, but she's not terribly interested in collage. It's not her jam. Honestly, she's probably outside talking to Els and Mike because they just got home. like there's not this is very stiff but I feel like there's not quite enough glue on the edge and then it's gonna lift and be a problem later because it's not very flexible I just tried with the glue stick lid onto the regular glue there we go that should help it stick down the thicker pieces are always a little bit harder to glue down that's off the cover of a magazine I do believe or some kind of ad that was thick. Okay. So we're doing this. A fountain. You know, there's always fountains everywhere. She's more likely to be in Elsa's life than mine. Except maybe Monday nights.
She's doing Sasha things. That's her jam. Not a whole lot of new stuff going on since yesterday, honestly. I'm working on buying stuff in the garage as usual. The internet went out last night and I about had a cow. It was in the middle of something. I'm like, there's no internet. But they were doing some service in the area, you know, upgrades and stuff. Uh, came back on about 5 o'clock this morning. So research-wise, I did not get much done. I had a whole thing I was trying to get done. But I did read a book, so there's that. I updated my Goodreads. All right, let's move this along. Let me get this live so I can make sure that's in ca that's in camera. Okay. Yeah, I think that's okay. It's a little bit sideways, but you know, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? I'm going to make a, a straight line across the top, and we're just going to put this right over here. Mm, that edge really wants to lift up, doesn't it? It would probably be good if I put the lid back on this. Lift over here, too. Well, I hope you have good luck selling your truck, Janie. I uh, I don't know much about how that stuff works. Although they did have the auto show every year in Scottsdale. In the spring, you got to see all kinds of super fun cars, you know. Barrett Jackson, that's what it was. The Barrett Jackson Auto Show. All kinds of stuff. It was right before bike week. So there's always a little overlap, it's a little weird, a little fun. But you get to see both, you know. There's some really awesome cars and motorcycles out there. Let's get that lined up. And then I smoosh some glue over here because it's on my finger. All right, we're getting a good start here. <laughs> no internet equals nap time for you. I was behind in my reading, so I read some kids' books. Uh, I read a, a Hardy Boys mystery. Last night I finished a, a Murder, She Wrote mystery, which was large print, which was so awesome. <laughs> um, I love the I love Murder, She Wrote in whatever form. So whenever I see the book, a book I haven't written, because there's a whole big long series of them uh, that are based on things that aren't. Uh, I think they're slightly different than the TV show. So I'll read those whenever I can find them. I uh, finished a little kid's chapter book uh, from the dollar store. It was a Creepers, uh, The Golden Chalice. <laughs> and I finished books 15 and 16 this week. In the Stephanie Plum series. I just get such a kick out of that show. Or that uh, series. Oh my god. The ridiculousness of it all, you know. So 
let's see. I don't know if I have very many pictures of like single. I have a whole bunch somewhere, but they haven't made it into this pile yet. Let's see if we can find some single dwelling homes. Single, some single, you know, individual homes. That's what I'm trying to say. I am trying to get there. Let's see. Okay, we've got a bus. Oops, that's going to cover up that guy's backyard. But we can trim down the bus some. And some people at a bus stop, right? Okay. Let's try that. So we can get... Yeah. I can put it up a little bit, like, to about right there. So, two. That'll be good. Uh-oh. I wonder why. Interesting. You can email it to me or message it to me and I'll I'll type it in. <laughs> They're taking the bus to look at homes. There you go. I swear I'm not reading erotica. YouTube doesn't like some very weird things, you know. Okay, so we want to do that right about there. I'm just going to put a little flat edge on there with the cutter because there's not much. You don't need to cut off much. Just make a flat edge. They look very happy about wherever. Maybe they're going for pancakes. They're going to look at houses and then go get pancakes. Everybody loves pancakes. In my world, everybody loves pancakes. I'm sure in the real world, not everybody loves pancakes. I'm going to do it like this so we don't cover up the front of the bus. So we need that pencil, and I don't know where it is. We're going to have to use a pen. Pen, 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 pen. And right here. It doesn't matter because we're covering it all up. Okay. Here we go. Oops. Well, that was a moment. Just gluing everywhere. Okay. We're gluing all over the place. What kind of house do we think they're looking for? So obviously, there's a. They're waiting for the bus with the dog, so they, maybe it's a service dog. I think that's the only kind of dog you can take on the bus. Here we go. Rolling out the glue. Sliding it around. Okay. There we go. And away we go with the bus. I hate to say it, but I kind of miss the bus. I'm sure if I rode the bus, I wouldn't miss it at all. I'd be like, oh, this is why. <laughs> I think I just miss going out of the house alone. <laughs> Those books are never added. I put everything I read in there. I have no shame. I have people that I've, uh, you know, friends with on there, <laughs> with air quotes. Um, and that's all they read. And they read lots of them because they're for quick reads, you know. Keeps, keeps was the word between body. Keeps the score. That's interesting. YouTube is so weird sometimes. Body keeps the score. Okay. 
My favorite thing to do is get Alexa to read those books in my candle. Nice. I'd like a machine to read to me. So they have a service dog and they're on the bus. Maybe they're looking for... So we're talking about people on a budget or someone who can't drive. Maybe you want them to look at this house. Let's see. Here's one of those kind of street scene deals. I think it's not there yet. Oh. Eh. Yeah, I guess that could do it, Carla. People can be difficult to say the least. Always trying to post their ideas on your, you know. Let's see. And it, they could look at a nice little townhome deal, right? Maybe a little tiny picture for right there. This is a good first session because it will let me know the things that I need to add, you know, what I need to keep an eye out for as far as neighborhood stuff goes. Do, 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 do. I'm just looking through some stuff here. Ooh, there's a few more pictures down here. Let me grab those. <sighs> I must have another envelope or bag of them somewhere. Okay. There's a fun door. Okay. Neighborhood cafe, right? Okay. <laughs> you have the book, Body Keeps the Score? I'll have to look it up. Okay, that picture's not quite big enough for up there. Neither is that one. I think we want to do that. So we need something, maybe. I think that would work. Trim the, okay, I think we've got it. I think I think I've got it. So let's start with this. <laughs> let's start with this one and work from there. I 
I want it to go right about there. Here we go. It's been a while since I've been so bad about getting online. So, you guys up for a magazine harvest tomorrow, maybe? You think? Maybe that would be... So maybe they're looking at this kind of schmancy. Just because they're on the bus does not necessarily mean they don't have money, right? Could just mean that the lady has got, you know, some kind of disability where she can't drive. But they like living in the city, you know? We'll see where they wind up. We'll find them a house. You could harvest from the harvest. I have a whole box of stuff that needs to be trimmed down. Okay. And we'll put this house with this door, but I need to cut a little bit off uh, the top there. Just a wee little bit. It's a little too tall for. There we go. I think that'll do it. I think that will make it all all right. Poor husband took the. Yeah, what an ass. Maybe she's leaving him. Maybe that's why they're on the bus. Incognito. He'd never expect that. Well, fooey on YouTube, Adria. I will, uh, when I go into do the next one, I'll put you on the, there's like a list of trusted people or whatever. I'll put you on there and see if that doesn't help release some of the restrictions. Carly's usually blue because sometimes she says things and YouTube doesn't like it. <laughs> So having her uh, blue with the blue panties uh, usually means they won't censor her or put her where her comment needs to be approved or whatever. But YouTube does have things that you can't type in certain numbers. I don't know why. Uh, some kind of... I'm sure it's rules they made up because of... Uh, Trolls and stuff, but sometimes it makes being on here difficult. I'll be in my own life sometimes and type something. They'll be like, "Nope, you can't do that." I'm like, "But it's my life." Okay, so I like to get that right there. So maybe they're looking at this nice little house. It's got a little yard, crushed rock gravel driveway. Okay, Mari, be safe. We'll see you in a little bit. Yeah, I think I'd like to do after Rosemary. Um, obviously. Um, because it is uh, Wednesday tomorrow, I think. I think today is Tuesday. Oh, my God. Yeah, because yesterday was Monday. We had Murder Monday. So wrapping up Jack the Ripper, I learned some new things I didn't know. And it was a nice refresher. I haven't, you know... I stopped watching the documentaries and stuff because they weren't really adding anything new. Um, but it's one of Elsa's favorite uh, serial killer things. So she's very passionate about it. Most people who are into the Ripper, they have, you know, not necessarily a pet theory, but they have an idea who they think it is. They have a favorite theory. And I've seen some very heated discussions. <laughs> Not just with Els, but with other people I've known, you know. And uh, I really like that. Maybe they like this one for the balcony. be a thing. And then we only need a little tiny strip of something there. 
I'm going to put her in eventually. Like we're walking down the street and there she is. Um, we think she's got, we think she's murdered her husband and buried him in the garden. So she's going to be in here somewhere coming up. I need to get a few more houses in. But yeah, I thought, I looked at her and I went, she's real happy about having murdered that dude, you know. <laughs> okay, that could go right there. And that's our farmer's market. That's, uh, I guess, what we need to name her and say that's her at the farmer's market. And then we need to trim around it a little bit. All right, so let's find ones that fit here. Oh, here we go. Will that fit? Yeah, yeah. Yes. You got to go over the bridge to the other side of the city. Okay, so let's start there. Let's get those nailed down. Okay, let's move this down a little bit. We've gone over the edge. We've gone over the edge. I have nothing. I fell asleep. <laughs> I'm real small. Yeah, so let's do a magazine harvest tomorrow. I miss being live. The videos are okay, but it's not the same as being here with you guys. And half the time, I don't manage to get the videos done anyway. I'm not very good at time management. I used to be great at time management. I don't know what happened to my brain. It's like it took a vacation and never came back. Right there's perfect. Oops. Stay down. Can't be having double lipstick over here. There's definitely plenty of glue. Okay, so I love this picture. I don't know why. It's like a fashion model thing, but it's in the background of a lot of stuff. But I love the balconies, the stone balconies. Janice, how you doing? Nurse Janice is in the house. You like being live with me? It probably because I'm ridiculous. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, I think I like that, like that. I like it like that. <laughs> Reason 427 why Amy should never sing. I can hear Al's out there watching something. A video. Her computer yells at her all day. She has the volume up really loud. Sometimes I have to close the door. I'm like, whoa, I can't hear me over this, over that. <laughs> sometimes think I'd have a headache if I listen to stuff that loud, but then I think about me watching horror movies and I'm like, it's just because it's not in front of you. <laughs> okay. What do you think? Kiki? Should we name her Kiki? Kiki at the farmer's market. She's always horking the blueberries. She's a blueberry horker. I'm going to cut it right there, though. Is that going to cut through the blueberries? Oh, well, we'll just live with the words. We'll try and put something over it. We can tear a little bit here. And a little bit here. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I think that'll work. Oops. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm going to tear a little bit more off the bottom here. There, I think that'll be good. I think that'll be good. Blueberry hooker. <laughs> oh, Mari. It takes all kinds, right?
you can sneak stuff by the box sometimes. Uh-oh. Well, hopefully nothing's on fire, Carla. You might want to go investigate. Could just be car alarms, too, though. Some of those are very terrible. Okay. So our blueberry hookers over here. There we go. All right, and then we're going to put this piece on. This is like a little, got a nice little bike path. So I'm thinking our family might want to you know, put a straight edge on the top. Find something near this parky area. Try and get down there as low as possible and still get a straight edge. Close enough for government work. There we go. Okay. That's actually a nice. Oh, come on. I got this one little bit over here that will not cooperate with me. Get your shit together. Okay. That that can't be good. Two of them. She's probably investigating. We'll have to we'll have to wait and find out what happens. I'm gonna put that right there. Let's roll this down a little bit. All right. Let's glue this puppy down. And then we'll look at the time. I have no idea how long we've been on. It's just somebody burning dinner, you know? Oh, we wanted this way up there. Oh, this is going to create a giant glue, glue trail. Oh, dear. Lost my mind there for a second. Yeah, could be worse. It's not like we're not gluing something down there. So that's not glued down. Uh oh, now I'm worried about Carla. Okay. We got a section here that needs a little more glue. Well, if she had to evacuate, I'm sure she'll. Let us know in time. Could just be some asshole pulling the fire alarm, too. Ah, the joy of living in apartments. Okay. So we need something here and something over here. While trying not to glue anything down to the gluey spot. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. 
what do we got? Too small. I like to get into the grouping of nice smaller. Smaller things. Sorry, do you guys have buffering? That's never a good sign, is it? Ooh. A little too short for that. What about that one, though? Goes a little high up. What if we shorten that a little? Okay. So far, so I need something small. Shorten that a little bit, but it's part of Chinatown, right? <laughs> Every city's got one. Oh, there we go. There we go. I think we got it. Well, now I'm just sitting. Mm -hmm. Carlo's okay. Okay. Oh, she's still there, but YouTube is blocking her chat. Um, so, Carla, if you can hear me, Adria went out and came back in. Yeah, I cannot chat. Okay, well, at least we know she's alive. That's a relief. <laughs> can't, we cannot, we have to have the Carla. We can't not have Carla. Well, actually, I think that's probably okay. Let's just, maybe we'll tear this little part off down here. And then we'll go like that. Yeah, let's do that. I don't know why YouTube's being such a... We'll wrap it up. This will be the last of what we do today. And then we'll come back next week. And hopefully tomorrow YouTube won't be being such a pain in the... Pimp your noodles. Oh my God, I missed a golden opportunity right there. Well, maybe this is a noodles restaurant like... Uh, a pho or something like that. And uh, they're pimping their noodles, man. Right next to the blueberry hoe, even. What did I do with that? Oh, there it is. Can you pimp your noodles next to a, a blueberry hoe? Is that is that a thing? Funky happenings. Yeah. I don't know why YouTube's being such a dick today. Probably because they call it a dip. So let's glue down these. Oh, those will work. We're going to put that right there. Okay. Let's do this. And then we'll. How long have we been on? About an hour, so that'll be good. I'd hope to do a little bit more than that, but if YouTube's being a... Eventually, it'll keep all of you from commenting. Probably. Seems to be a trend. <laughs> First, it didn't like Adria's book. It doesn't like Carla's alarm. What's next? Probably take away my, my audio. Because <laughs> that's happened before. Okay, let's get you all squared up. Okay, then we're going to do this one right here and that one down there. It's the other way around. that one right back there. Okay.
Okay, so let's trim the, ad the bottom off this. A little bit of it. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. So we got to put this one on first. Okay, let me have a look at my email. Oh. I'm sorry. I don't know what's up YouTube's butt today. Bad YouTube, bad. Kicking out perfectly nice ladies. YouTube is a jerk. Okay. So let's glue this down. We're wrapping it up, ladies. I'm sorry. Figures I try and come on and do something alive and YouTube wants to be a, a dickhead about it. We will try again tomorrow, though. We'll I'll come on after Rosemary, and we'll do some kind of harvesting. Either I have I have a big ass pile of magazines I need to get through. Um, I had to move some things around in my room. There was an incident, um, and so I need the space where those magazines were. And trust me, it's a big ass pile. I'll take a picture of it, put it on Insta. I need to be so much better about my social media. Oh my god, I suck at it. It is not my strong suit, I'll tell you that much. I love it in theory. I love to go on Instagram and look at people's stuff. I just suck at doing it. Maybe because I'm not much of a phone person and the Insta is really a phone thing. I used it more when my tablet was working, i got to be honest. But uh, I, I need to get better about it. And I got to get back on the whole scraps of joy thing. I little fell off the wagon a little bit. But well. Okay, I fell off the wagon a lot. But it's never too late to begin again, again, again. Always time to make improvements and get your shit together. It's really what life is about. Just you getting your shit together over and over again. Not you personally. I'm really talking about me. It's always some shit I gotta get together. Well, I think you should all thumbs down this video because YouTube's being a butthead. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, I have one last image I want to put on today because, you know, every... Every city, every town's got to have one of these. Yes, my, uh, it's in the, there's a link in the, in the description box at the bottom where there's links to all my things. Okay. Because every city's got to have a pimp or a whole, a whole stroll, right? We'll need something small for right there. I kept this one special for us, ladies. <laughs> I'm going to tear off part of this, though, at the bottom. So we'll go right about there. You got to have a whole a whole stroll. So I thought we'd put it in early and see if we can't expand on it later on. We'll have to come back in with some names and put some names on some of these things. We got Kiki the Blueberry Ho. Hopefully you guys will remember that because I'll probably forget before I can get a name on her. We'll do that at the beginning of the next one. Put some names on a couple of these. Maybe some city areas. Give it some of the areas a name. And here's our start of our ho stroll.
Felt like I had to do it. It was an inside fire alarm. But no fire, right, Carla? You're all safe and nobody's in danger of getting there. There. Keister's roasted. We don't want you to be human schmores. That would be no fun. Okay, I'm just looking for something small to go right there because that's going to drive me a little bit bananas. Pink telephone. Do, 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 do. This whole pile is upside down. That's a little too big. Eiffel Tower, that seems wrong. Nope, too skinny. What about that? That's totally different than everything around it. Let's do that. Here's another house our fam our, our our mom and her dog and her daughter looked at. This one's got like a double porch on it. How interesting is that? I love a good big porch. I like big porches. And I cannot lie. Come on glue. i got to refill this glue before we come on again for glue and things. Here we go. Maybe it's park adjacent. <laughs> Maybe it's the childhood home of our hoe and she just had to let her freak flag fly and she couldn't do it in this traditional home. All right. Let me get the glue, the glue on the lid. Yeah. Let's put the lid on the glue and then have a look at what we've done. We're ending with the stro the whole stroll. All right. And here we are. We're going back. Kiki, our blueberry hoe. And then there's the very start of our collage roll right there. So we'll roll it back the other way. It's a little shiny, huh? Sorry about that. So you've got a great start, I think. I'll look for we'll look for some houses and some other fun things so we can put in our our murdering gardener and other stuff. Garden, nope, no, good. That's good. That's good. Well, I'm sorry that a bunch of you ladies could not talk. I feel bad about that, stupid YouTube. But we will be back tomorrow night uh, after Rosemary, so about seven fifteen. I like to give you guys time to get a snack, a drink, go to the potty if you you know if you've been in Rosemary's life, you don't want to. You don't want to go straight from one live to another. That's, you know, woof. Give you a few minutes. <laughs> but we'll either be harvesting from the box or harvesting from the magazine. Um, and we'll go for about an hour or so. I'm going to wipe this page off with some with a wet towel. There's some serious glue smeared on there. Okay. Um, I don't know what to do with that paper towel, honestly. I've lost the paper towel again. <laughs> All right. So however you guys are spending your days and nights, I hope it brings you great joy and happiness. Each and every one of you absolutely deserves it. 
until I see you in one of my lives or in a box somewhere. I wish you guys the happiest of crafting. Bye, 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 bye. Bright blessings and hugs and hisses to you all. And um, thanks for the thumbs up or the thumbs down or whatever you managed to get in there, if it was agreeable at all. Um, that's the end. Good night, Christine and Mari and Carla and Adria and Sherry and Janice and, and, uh, oh goodness. And Janie, if you're still in here, love you guys. Push the button. We're pushing the button. The end.